When it comes to the city of brotherly love, Philly knows how to make a good sandwich. And most people across the world know Philly is known for the iconic cheese steak. But other iconic sandwiches when it comes to Philly staples include the classic hoagie and the roast pork sandwich. Now in this video, we're going to journey to Umi D's, which is a burger bistro, which is located at 2805 North 22nd Street, right on the corner of 22nd and Somerset, directly in the heart of North Philly. So I'm actually going to shoot down the Umi D's to try out the iconic Philly cheesesteak. And this isn't any ordinary cheesesteak. This is an oxtail cheesesteak. And for my oxtail lovers, this is the perfect sandwich for you. As a matter of fact, I was even told by somebody that they'll rather have the oxtail cheesesteak than an actual oxtail Jamaican platter. Now, why does that matter? Because sometimes in the Jamaican platter, you don't get as much meat with your oxtails. But when you get that oxtail cheesesteak from Umi D's, you'll probably never go back to Jamaican D's. Welcome to Smash the Light TV. Now, Umi D's Burger Bistro was inspired by Miss Debbie Dawson, who passed in 2018 after battling stage four cancer for over a decade. Debbie Dawson's recipes will continue to live on and forever through Umi D's Burger Bistro. So let's check out this oxtail Philly cheesesteak by moving on with this video. Now, my aim was to come down here the day before but something told me to call and when I called, you know, they were sold out. And this was like early in the afternoon, they were sold out. So, you know, this particular day I said to myself, let me try to get them as soon as they open. So, um, you know, I took a drive down there, not a far drive for myself. And um, I was happy I did, man. You know, um, I like salmon cheese steaks and they have some really good salmon cheese steaks. Um, my aim was to go for the oxtail cheese steak because I haven't had that. I've had a salmon cheese steak before. So my taste buds told me to go for the oxtail cheese steak. And I like oxtails. Um, generally, when I get Jamaican food, I normally go for the jerk chicken. Um, it's rare that I get oxtails because they don't really give you a lot of meat. Like if I was to do oxtails, I'd rather buy the oxtails and cook them myself. Um, but when I saw a uh, advertisement for the oxtail cheesesteak and I kind of saw some pictures and things like that, the Umi D sandwich, I said, man, you know, I love oxtails, but I really don't get a chance to buy them from Jamaican stores because I feel like they don't give you enough. You know, the portions are small. Um, not unless y'all show me a spot. Anybody coming to this video, if you know a Jamaican spot who sell oxtails in good portions, you know, leave a comment so I, you know, so I can go check them out. Nevertheless, um, I don't see too many good, well-sized portions when it comes to oxtails. So, like I said, I'll rather buy the oxtails and cook them myself. However, when I ran into photos about this oxtail cheesesteak, I said, yeah, let me go down here and check it out. And um, I'm glad I did. I suggest y'all get a chance to go down there as well. If you're a cheesesteak lover, if you're a sandwich lover, because they have good burgers as well. Um, the strawberry lemonades are good. The overall eating experience is good. I don't think there's anything there that would not satisfy you, in other words. So, yeah, man, find you some time to slide on down there. You can't go wrong. You won't be disappointed. But I suggest if you're coming from a little distance, a few miles or what have you, just call first. Because, like I said, I might have called. They open at 12 p.m. Yesterday, I might have called at about... Um, Five o'clock, maybe it was almost maybe six o'clock. They closed at 10 o'clock, you know, it was well into the afternoon and they were sold out. You know, um, another a friend of mine actually called just to verify to make sure that I called the right number to make sure that they were sold out because we really wanted to go. And sure enough, when she called, they said that they were sold out. So um, I would call before I go because the, the sandwiches and the steaks, the food is, is awesome. So um, there's going to be people lined up. When I got down there, when they opened, it was a line. So, yeah, this it's a busy little spot, and rightfully so. The store is open Monday through Saturday. However, on Mondays and Tuesdays, the hours of operation is from 12 p.m. to 9 p.m. But Wednesday through Saturday, it's from 12 p.m. to 10 p.m. 
But like I said, just call. If you're coming from a distance, just call before you come down so you're not disappointed because they sell out quickly. Now, just to give you some insight into how other people feel about Umi D's, I'm going through some of the reviews and I'll read them. Um, this is a Vincent Mills who posted a review who said, I've been here five times in the past, like three or so years, and I'm still introducing people to this place. I've only really had their salmon cheese steaks and their fries, but honestly, this really has to be my favorite place to get cheese steaks without a question. Please visit here if you're passing by North Philadelphia. And it's right in the heart of North Philly, 22nd and Somerset. Nice little location, um, transportation friendly. You know, it's right in the heart of the area where transportation can reach the place. Um, I'm going to go to another review. Let me see here. Here's a review from Sylvia McFarlane. She said, the food is really delicious. The customer service is awesome. They're very friendly people. I most definitely will eat there again and again and again. And I agree with the The customer service was awesome. I mean, the young lady, I believe she was the owner. Friendly, polite. I mean, yeah, I don't know what more you can ask for from customer service. You generally just like a, a friendly engagement, a friendly interaction. And you want to feel like people are doing your food well, right? And she gives that vibe off. Um, that's why I posted some of these videos, some of these shots of the operation. So you can kind of see how they operate. And it's a good crew back there. You know what I'm saying? They keep everybody at bay while in line because it can get packed. So they have very good customer service skills. I agree with that. Another review from Sharif Saunders said, I've been eating here twice, sometimes three times a week since their opening in 2018. And the staff is always welcoming and in great spirits. I've had pretty much everything on the menu three times and the food has been astounding since day one. It seems as if it improves each time. 10 out of 10 would recommend to anyone seeking great food with not so long wait times in the Philadelphia area. I agree with this review 100% because they do be packed. And that's why I said their customer service is great. They are friendly. They know how to talk to you. And when it gets packed, they know how to, you know, talk to the people and keep them kind of at bay while, you know, the food is being prepared. And they have a good order so that they can get people in and out without much of a headache. And the final review is from Martha Hole. She said, my first time in Man Oh Man, it was good and flavorful. I will be back. I never liked salmon before, but you got me hooked. Now, I think that's telling in and of itself to make somebody that don't like salmon like salmon. And yes, the sandwiches are flavorful. As a matter of fact, you're going to notice that I say that when I try the oxtail cheesesteak. So let's head into that portion of the video where I go ahead and indulge and try to find out what it's hitting for. I have to come up and grab you some. Boomy D's, oxtail cheesesteaks, salmon cheesesteaks, best in the city. 22nd and Somerset. Get out here. The oxtail cheese steak with the strawberry lemonade.